Hello students, so intermediate second year botany sammanthi microorganism and the bacteria chapter lo ni two more questions so sorry discuss chet them and the first question write briefly on the occurrence of microorganisms so microorganisms and the ekada ekada one time so microorganisms are these are omnipresent it means it can present any conditions any places yes. so it may be present soil it may be present water molecules it may be present in the air also right so ivi ekadaina andu bottle untai soil lo untai water lo untai adhe vidhanga gaali lo kuda manaku andu bottle untai ekada kanipistai anamata so these are omnipresent <coughs> they uh, also they are described as ubiquitous so ubiquitous omnipresent next question define microbiology so microbiology ante emi so what is a microbiology so study of microorganisms study of microorganisms like bacteria viruses and protozoans so study of microorganisms like bacteria virus protozoans are called microbiology next question name the bacteria which is a common inhabitant in human intestine how is it used in biotechnology so human intestine lo unde microorganism enti adi ye vidhanga biotechnology lo use avutundi anedi so human intestine lo unde bacteria vachesi escherichia coli simple ga e coli antam it is present in human intestine so ye vidhanga use avutundi ante it is used in the production of insulin so insulin production lo manaku ee e coli anedi use avutundi right what are pleomorphic bacteria give an example so pleomorphic bacteria ante emi example adignadu so pleomorphic bacteria ante emi actually ga based on the shape bacteria are different types coccus bacillus vibrio okay so ee vidhanga avi aithe okoka bacteria oka shape lo untundi but some bacteria are they can change their shape based on the surrounding environment and based on the availability of nutrition so those are called pleomorphic bacteria ante perfect shape lo undakunda avi vaati yokka environment ki anukulanga vaati yokka nutrition ki anukulanga ee bacteriums evaithe shape nu change chestuntayo aa bacteriums ni pleomorphic bacteria antaru example vachesi acetobacter next question what is sex pillars and what is its function so six pillars ante ente daniki function enti so bacterium lo especially f plus bacterium lo a tubular structure is present uh, that is called as six pillars it is involved in the conjugation process it means it is uh, useful to the transfer of genetic material from one bacteria to another bacteria f plus bacterium cell to f minus bacterium cell and the conjugation process lo use ayye tubular structure ni manamu six pillars antaram so ee em chestundi it transfers the genetic material between two bacterium cells next question what is a xenophore so xenophore ante enti so xenophore is nothing but main genetic material in bacterium cell is called xenophore so bacterium lo unde main genetic material nu xenophore antunam so xenophore is a naked circular double stranded spirally coiled genetic material that is dna that is called xenophore uh, so it is also called as bacterial chromosome also called as bacterial chromosome so next question what is a plasmid what is its significance so plasmid ante enti daniki significance ante enti okay ikkada so bacterium contains xenophore and also extra genetic material in that bacterium cell so that extra genetic material called as plasmid so plasmid ante bacterium cell lo unde extra genetic material nu plasmid antunam plasmids also naked circular double stranded spirally coiled genetic material that is dna so ee plasmid yokka function bacterium ke vidhanga undadu aithe plasmids are used in rdna technology as a vector so vector ga recombinant dna technology lo ee plasmids ni use chestam so next question what is conjugation who discovered it in which which organism so conjugation ante ente ye organism lo evaru identify chesinaru so conjugation means transfer of genetic material 
from one battery cell to another battery cell through conjugation tube. Through conjugation tube is called conjugation. It is discovered by Lederberg and Tatum in Escherichia coli. Next question. What is transformation? In who discovered it? In which organism? So transformation means transfer of naked genetic material from the surrounding into the bacterium cell. So it is nothing but uptake of naked genetic material, uptake of naked DNA into bacterium cell is called transformation. So here, naked genetic material DNA bacterium cell like enter kagane, it is incorporated with bacterium cell. So bacterium cell to incorporate IP then function center chest. So a process no transformation and term. It is identified, it is discovered by Frederick Griffith in Streptococcus pneumoniae. Frederick Griffith and a scientist to Streptococcus pneumoniae an organism lo identified chad in Jarigindi. So next question is chesi, what is transduction? E, who discovered it in which organism? So transduction and TNT, this organism lo yore identified chesh naro. So transduction means transfer of genetic material from one bacterium cell to another bacterium cell through bacteriophage virus. So transfer of genetic material from one bacterium cell to another bacterium cell through bacteriophage virus is called transduction. It is discovered by Lederberg and Ginder. Lederberg and Ginder in Salmonella typhimerium. Lederberg and Ginder in Salmonella typhimerium. Mm -hmm.